Hello, today we will be here. Um, I am very sorry about uh, how long I've been gone. Uh, I was trying to wait for school to get out so I could just record pretty much whatever I wanted to, but that's not gonna happen for another month. So I was like, you know what? I'm just gonna start recording again. So, I am sorry that I have been gone for so long. I am going to start recording more often. So, yeah. Uh, also, Jer, if you see this video, if you're wondering why I haven't been on with you, uh, I just kind of timed out on gaming, pretty much. I was just like, well, I just play a few games on my laptop at this point. Point because the, I'm at my aunt's almost all the time, and if you guys don't know, she doesn't have Wi-Fi there. So, yeah. But anyway, today we are playing a, like, special, uh, thing. Um, a weapon, the weapon expansion pack. And if you guys are wondering, no, this is not an actual mod pack, because I do not play on Java Edition. I'm playing on my Xbox, as usual. Uh, but anyway, there's a dagger, spears, hey, all those battle axes. Personally, I use the battle axe most of the time, but I made some of the other weapons to show you guys. Um, and then there's Forged Obsidian, Obsidian Weapon, Forged Emerald, Emerald Weapon, Sword of Thunder, which I actually like, it's pretty cool, uh, Sword of Storms, kind of dumb, uh, Sword of Explosions, well, good for killing yourself. By the way, if the dev ever watches this video, no, I am not taking offense to any of these weapons, they are all very, very cool. Um, but anyway, and then we have turret bases, turret tops, you can make a turret, you can put different types of arrows in it, you can make a PET, I know that's supposed to be PET, but, like, it's supposed to stand for PET because you can't really put, okay, moving on. You know, it basically follows you around if you tame it with redstone, and then you can set it down or make it follow you. Oh, but it's probably going to die to, like, a witch or something. Also, there's a battle arena, so... Uh, that's a thing. Uh, and then there are different spells like Fireball here, Flame Burst, Meteor Shower, Wind, you know, Lightning Strike, Tornado, Freeze, Regeneration Field, Bubble, Boulder Smash, Earth Strike, Shelter. So, there are a lot of different, but, like, for example, here's the stone battle axe. Kind of just swings like this, uh, and then the stone axe, uh, is actually, like, modded looking, kind of. If you get what I'm saying as well. <sighs> Excuse me, I just woke up. Um... And then, of course, we have our stone spear here that we apparently just slap people in the head with. Okay, whatever. And then the stone flail, pretty much the same thing. But, you guys know me. Of course, considering I have this in the first bar of my hotbar, of course I do use this. Also, my current food is going to be melons. But, like, I do not set up this farm. This farm comes pre-set up and I love the farm area. Oh, and no one started insulting me for making a sapling growth area. I thought it was like the perfect place. So, dirt, so and see. Rings in the background and there's your sapling growing area. I thought it looked pretty cool so I don't want to hear a whole bunch of insults in the comments. But anyway, of course, if we go up, because that's like the storage area in the bedroom. This is where you initially would enter when you start it. Uh, this is the arena where you, if you hit 
the buttons, you can battle different mobs with your different awesome weapons. And just generally get some items from said mobs. Actually, wait, I don't think you can, sir. Uh, and then, I'm not sure what this room is, but I'm thinking it's like the potion store in the room, considering how many broom stands are in it. But either way, this this room is amazing looking. Oh, and these are actual working training dummies. Like, I can't die. And they do damage your weapon. But it can kind of show you how fast your weapon is going to attack if you're on Java. Considering you've been here. And then, of course, we have our nether portal here. Because, um... If you didn't notice from the book, a majority of the recipes require netherite. And, of course, we have our ancient table with books and lapis. Amazing. Oh, and if you're wondering where I got this level leather armor, it's from, like, an extension in the farming area. And then we go one more level up. And we can go into the open world. And then this is just a path to an abandoned village. I found some iron over there last time I played this. But this time I played I was like, yeah, I'm just going to go all the way down. Because I think the farm is all the way down. And then I found out they actually made a mine, which is amazing. Like that that's that's so amazing. By the by these different buttons have like different arrow parts and then that one just says teleport and day. Uh that teleport one is the mine by the way. Okay. But anyway, where I found this leather armor is like right over here, this armor stand. Also, if you try to get them the united ish weapons, they it doesn't show it. But like if you get yeah. So that's how that looks. But anyway, uh this armor stand here comes equipped with a full set of leather for you. But I mean you don't need leather for long, it's just usually for these split. But either way, I'd say as a rating, this map is definitely one out. I mean, why did I say that? Uh, 10 out of 10. Because, like, there, I never really see this storage area. This is the main thing that does it for me. Oh, and then one more thing. I mean,. You can't yell at me. It's a king size bed with a nice dresser next to it. <laughs> oh goodness! You guys didn't know in real life. I actually just like sleep on the couch. But either way, I mean, we can't go to the mine without torches, because like it doesn't come equipped with torches. And I mean, considering how oh good the map is, I don't need. It. I don't think. That it needs to. Ah, there's a fruit fly in my face. I don't know why, but they have been all day. It will literally hurt. Also, the elevator animation is amazing. Okay. Good. Of course, since you can't sleep in the whole bed. I'm going to sleep in one room. Um, and I just kind of use this one. Okay, I get- Ah, oh, boys, there's all this fruit fly in my face! Okay. Hey, I think our trees have grown. Come here, tree, then I'm going to cut you down. Cut you down. You know what? I 
should probably be punching with something that was not. Come on, please do. And by the way, before you guys start commenting, I know that you get more uh, items from just letting it decay, but if I just let it decay, my other tree is going to be waiting for a while. So I'm just going to hope I get two samples of this. Which it looks like I did not. Never mind, I got two sevens of that. I should just show them out. Um, but anyway, that does that there. So we have four one loads. Four one loads. You know what, Joel? It would probably help if you went in the right room, you idiot. Um, no, why? Also, there are mobs behind the room, but I mean, who, who really cares? Like, it's, an, it's an awesome looking map anyway. I mean, who cares if there are mobs? Like, every good map has some mobs here in it. Even though if it's about mobs, it usually has some vanilla mobs somewhere. So, yeah. Okay. Um, for smell. Charcoal has been smelted. Of course, go into the class. Like, amazing broken type. Oh, by the way, like, there are daggers. All the good stuff and all the good things. Ah, uh, and there's a fruit fly in my face. Of course. Classic. Literally classic. I'm technically. Wait, um, is this considered a classic? I don't know. Uh, and don't put that in the comments, please. I don't need to know where my couch is a classic. <laughs> oh, wait, no, it's not, because the thing. And the tablet's sitting on is a classic bookmark directly, but. I think you guys get a message. No, I don't need massage. Is that correct? Yeah, that looks correct enough to me as it is. Yeah, it's a good one, pretty stupid. Also, nice exploitable iron, love it. Um, you know what? How about I don't replace this sweet stone because I'm not wasting time or resources, which would be like nothing because I have no time. If you're wondering why I'm not okay with leaving you in one space open in bedrock. Even one space can spawn, spawn a baby zombie. I am not accepting the fact of that. <coughs> uh, excuse me. Keep in mind, I'm still waking up. Because, like, I woke up at 8 and it's, like, 8.20. The fudge is dirt. Okay, there seems to be dirt. Dirt, dirt, dirt. Well, we're just gonna annoyingly have to listen to them. Dumb zombie. You're like, I'm a zombie, I'm stupid. That's my definition of what a zombie sounds like. Hey, zombie, you wanna hear my definition of you? Hey, I'm a zombie, I'm stupid, and I make weird noises every two seconds to annoy the 
out of Joel. Hmm. So, yeah. And yes, I do know you need 24 hours to make a full set. But like, we need a battle axe and stuff as well. Ooh, and emerald. We need to mine that because around here, emeralds are rare and very, very useful. Diamonds would be useful, but I mean, you can't get everything you wish for. Am I right, Mr. Furnaces? And before you guys start screaming, I know it's for a Wait, I didn't check these chests. And no, I'm not gonna check the whole storage system because I know that's empty. Wait, how many furnace? Is that only a few more? Whatever. Uh, four, eight, ten. Okay. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, okay, there. You know what? Why don't I just <clears throat> ignore that? Please, my trees are growing, my hay. And yes, I do know it's probably my time again. <clears throat> it's not too interesting or sleeping at the moment. All the instincts I really need to gather wood and smoke my beautiful iron. Plus, I mean, if I have a giant battle axe, I mean, what mob's gonna attack me? Especially if it's made out of iron. Hmm, ding dong mobs. I swear, mobs could attack you while you have a blade that's three times the size of your face. And they would think they're fine. Uh, if you have, if the person you're fighting has a blade three times the size of your face, you're obviously not going to be fine. Just doing Minecraft mobs. Hey, actually, there's... Well, that's cobblestone. <clears throat> nice. Oh, uh, well. Well, Joel, girl, I guess you haven't grabbed all the wood because this is the worst tree in the history of trees. I, if you guys didn't know this already, I cannot stand these dumb giant trees. They don't even give you that much of a reward in wood. And considering how much of the wood that you use that they take. So I I just can't wear my head around it. I had to go learn to an eight oak. Alright, so I'll take it. I'll take it. You you Wait a minute. I believe three should be good, right? Can I get off cheeky with this? Oh wait, no, it's it's gotta be. Ah, darn it! Just no time. Four, 
already know the partners. Yes, and iridium battles. And yes, I did just purposely say iridium battles. For wonder why it's so uh, if my mom is up just to annoy her back to sleep. Oh well. Um but either way, why not make a sheet? Cause, you know, reasons and stuff and things. I don't know my thing, but I never make an iron pickaxe unless I actually like, need it to gather a resource. In my case, I actually need it. To gather the stone resources. And you know what? Just to go along with the set, why not make the rest of the iron set? And an iron helmet. Because, well. Now, let me switch that out. And before you guys yell at me in the comments, I know Shield can do that. So I don't want to hear any nasty comments about me. But, uh, you know what? Iron Axe is just actually a general upgrade to Stone Axe. Now, if you're wondering why I'm doing this, no, I do not have the inventory tweaks, man. I was asking you to think of these things. And yes, I do know how to use the shield. Also, favorite part of this whole little living area? There's a potted cactus. I mean, consider it. Oh, well, I better not turn it on. So I don't see it up there. Um. Whee! Some more stuff. Okay, next. Wait, did I set up in there? Well, I suppose these big trees are good for one thing. And before you ask why I'm not just using the battle axe, it doesn't. It. I don't know what. I think it's literally just a modded pencil. This is like one of the very few like marketplace things that I've actually found that I really, really like. Like I never really liked doing the marketplace stuff because I've seen the majority of you guys is watching this, don't really like it. And I can see why. Because, like, nah, some of them are pretty boring. I got an extension edge into the mob. Boring. And no, I'm not just saying generally marketplace things are boring. Like, I think the creators do an amazing job. When they make the different mod packs. I'm just saying, like. Wait, does anyone need a duck? Joel, that's a stone pickaxe. Can't believe what I almost just did. I can't believe what I actually almost just did. Like, that would have been terrible. You're wondering why I made the shield. It's so that mobs 
one just attacked me and then I just immediately died because I have pretty much exclusively low down. And before you guys go around asking, no, I do not know how mobs attack in this. I haven't been attacked by a mob before, and I would like to keep it that way, but I know I can't. Because I've done something. Also, I don't know what version of ores these are, but I'm telling you, these aren't the same ores I'm used to playing. I mean, I wouldn't expect it, but... I mean, you can't give people everything they want. Like, I'm satisfied with what's here. Like, seriously. This is an amazing. It's just amazing. What you can do. Oh uh, yeah, no, these are, these are some pretty weird ores. What's the ores we're so by the developer, but I doubt it. That reminds me of a Javi. Javi. Java eating animation. And before you're wondering, no, I do not play Java. I got a trial for it once, and then I was like, you know what, I'm not going to do it. Because I would have had to upload my skin, my profile, everything, and I was like, it's just not something that's good. Uh, so, yeah, but I noticed the emissions like that. Oh, also, I watch YouTube videos like crazy back in the day. So, yeah. Also, I've continued the most in this mine. I would like to keep it that way. Now that we have collected the emerald and the gold and the redstone, let's move back with a stone pick. And before you ask, no, I do not know that there are some small mobs in this world. Also, I walk sideways. Like that, it's because I'm doing something in real life and not really paying attention to my screen too much. So, uh, there, the torch. I shouldn't say the torch. I actually had a block dug out from the end, so I should probably just continue. YouTube video, darn it. Darn it. Thanks for just letting my record for once. <coughs> well, maybe this is the old general supply now. <coughs> or maybe the dev is just amazing at putting ores down. Whichever, I am liking this bit of coal. Cause like I saw a cool elevator, but that would just be grieving, and I'm not okay with that. Um, also, I think I have over a stack of cowboy skin. Also, if you're wondering. What happened to all my PC gameplay? I noticed that none of it really had audio, and I was like, you know what, I'm just gonna stop on this. Cause like, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna make, make this channel into a channel like some of those other channels, where they just put it in like, chats of the games. Because if you guys do not know, no I do not. Usually play on private servers. Unless it's a game with like a free, a free, a free private server or something. 
Then, sure, I might play on it, but still, you should be doubtful about it. Because I'm just not a guy that likes to play on different types of stuff. Why is there a fruit fly on my chin? Okay. These fruit flies are everywhere today. I mean, since when aren't they? Also, I watched back a video Jerry uploaded a good while ago about me and him doing her Fortnite, and I laughed for like the entire rest of the night. Like it was hilarious. Also, he yelled at he yelled at me for not getting in a car that he soon after telling me to get in and saying well the enemy was gonna leave without me, and I went like good. And he was like, trust me, you'll regret it. And I was like, you'll regret it. And then he blows it up. And almost dies to it. And then complains, when I die, when I'm fully surrounded by bots. And then he just comes in with a derpy pistol. And no, I'm not torturing you with derpy pistol. Um, and... And then three seconds later, we drive into the storm. Well, technically, he was driving. I was just kind of chilling. <laughs> I was just like, dun, dun, chilling, dun, chilling, dun, chilling. Okay, that was that was kind of creepy. Okay, what? Getting some iron now. Cause I mean, who didn't like iron radium in mine? And yes, I did just purposely say that. Iron Yep, good job, Joel. You managed to call iron iron rhenium. <laughs> I need to stop. Oh, that's a little bit. Hmm, I already know what I'm gonna call this episode, and I know it's gonna be derpy, and everyone's gonna be like, Joel! <laughs> okay, I need to shut my mouth. I need to shut my mouth. I need to shut my mouth. Now, if you're wondering why I'm recording so early, uh, I have to leave at like 1 o'clock for my mom's house. So, yeehaw. Also, why? It oh, my guys. What was that noise?